To change keyboard theme in Z Flip 6, I'll cover three ways. The first way is we open settings, then we will scroll all the way down until we see general management. Then we will select the Samsung keyboard settings. Now, if you have Samsung as your default keyboard, you will have that option. And we should see if we scroll down the theme. And the reason why I'll show three ways is because this is the first way and we do have limited themes here. You can see only four. Now, if you want to easily change a theme, then what we'll do is we will download Gboard from the Google Play. And once this is downloaded, we'll head back into our settings and we'll head back into general management. And instead of selecting our Samsung keyboard settings, below it, we will select the keyboard list and default. We will then turn on our third party Gboard keyboard. This is made by Google, so it's safe. And then we will select the default keyboard and we'll change this to uh, Gboard. And then we'll head out of the keyboard list and default and we'll head into the Gboard settings. And so this is the second way. By changing our keyboard to Gboard, we can head to theme and we have a lot more themes available for Gboard. So we can select whatever one we want and then we can apply and we can take a look at the results. Now the third way is if you want to use Samsung Keyboard but change the theme to whatever you want in Samsung Keyboard. So I will first set the default back to Samsung Keyboard. Then we need to download a couple of third party apps. So we're going to open Samsung Galaxy Store, not Google Play. And we need to download, first of all, the Good Lock app. If you don't see this app, this isn't in all regions. So you have to Google how to change Galaxy Store region to see this. And then we'll also search for the Keys Cafe. And we'll also download Keys Cafe. Now we will open Keys Cafe. And once it opens up, we will allow all permissions. These apps are made by Samsung, so they are safe to use. And so we see make your own keyboard, style your own keyboard. So if we select the style your own keyboard and we turn this one on, we have these custom looks that we can choose. And we have effects here. And so I'll just choose one of these. And so it wants me to also download Theme Park. So we'll download this one as well. And we'll head back into Keys Cafe and we'll retap the custom look we wanted. And then we'll select Apply. And now it's applied. So if we look at my keyboard here, this is the Samsung keyboard, fully customized. And if we head to the homepage of Keys Cafe, under Make Your Own Keyboard, you can completely, you know, remap all the keys using this option. I'm not going to show it in this video. Style your own keyboard is where most of the customization settings are available.